Kiwi Dads is a movement of Kiwi Dads who are proud to be fathers, believing if you don't train at being a good dad, you can't get better. To tell us more in light of Father's Day this Sunday, please welcome to the cafe, Will Fleming and Greg Buckley. Yes. Hi, Hi, Tim. Happy here. Thank you so much Lovely for having a couple everyday blockhead dads on your show. With your so denim cool. cut-off jackets very smooth. Oh, that was just an accident, <laughs> by yeah. the way. Totally. We just planned it. Didn't yeah. read each other up. Um, well, you created Red Dads. What inspired you to start it? I guess a couple of things. My kids, thinking of my old man and the weird stuff he did. And he certainly wasn't prepared for being a dad today. Mm. So this is a love letter to all those old dads saying, good try, but we can do a bit better. And what would you say, Greg, about what Rad Dads is all about? Rad Dads, I guess, as, at its heart, is about a celebration of the everyman. You know, um, there's these dads that are getting up, going to work, trying to do right by the kids, trying to do right by um, by mum, and just getting into the engine room of life. And it's, I guess, it's a, a bit of an unglamorous existence. And um, we just wanted to say, hey guys, well done, well done on being prepared to put in the hard yards and do the right thing. Um, you know, there's there's champions for a lot of things these these days, and I think a, a lot of the time it's um, the unsung heroes that kind of go missed. Yeah, yeah. The, the, the dads doing the getting the mm. job done. Um, well, what's the response been like from dads? It's been awesome. Look, Kiwi dads aren't the ones to go, yeah, they just push the like button and comment, nice job, fellas. But the mums are coming in too and saying, finally, blokes are talking about real life stuff. And, and we think that's, let's start with that problem, getting people to talk, and then we can work on bigger problems like yeah. that. And speaking of that, you know, the issues can be serious, but you have a bit of fun along the way as well, don't you? You know, you that's how we do it. You've got, to, you've got to make a joke about guys not being able to talk to each other. And there's always a deeper tone. But again, I would say, let's start there. Let's mm. just have a laugh, get along, and then we can worry about what's happening in America and all that kind of stuff. Because the thing is, is that mothers have lots of outlets for this. We have coffee groups, loads of Facebook groups mm. for mums, but not so many for dads. That's true. No, no, and, and I think that that's the thing. It's, it's, it's really a, quite a simple thing. It's, you know, you talked about humour. We, we've found that uh, if we can be uh, a little bit funny, have a bit of a laugh, and I guess we've also found the barbecue to be quite helpful, get people uh, around a, a bit of an open flame and eating. It's those two things kind of open up a raft of opportunities. We're simple guys. Um, you know, we're simple, simple critters, I guess, us Kiwi dads, and it's just really going, how do we get that conversation started? How do we uh, create an environment where those guys feel safe, mm. um, that they're not going to be judged, they're not going to be called out for, you know, maybe saying or doing the wrong thing? Yeah. Um, and just, yeah, letting them have at it and have a chat. Mm. Oh, I love it. I love the philosophy behind it. And you've been really lucky too. You've been supported by some incredible guests. Um, I know Bill English, the yep. Prime Minister, um, <laughs> right as he became Prime Minister, was on your show, yeah. and also so Mike McRoberts. Yeah, I mean, these dads aren't requiring, you know, anything from us. The pitch is, will you come and talk about being a father? Take the professional hat off and put the dad hat on. And so when the Prime Minister came, I said, can we call you Bill? <laughs> and I wear my backwards hat? And he was like, yeah, that's fine. I looked at the team and they were like thumbs up. So nice. And then yeah. I mean I, I remember that day quite quite vividly. It was a it was a, um, a certainly an interesting day at work. I got absolutely soaked. I ride a scooter, um, and I got absolutely soaked on the way to the interview. Got changed in the countdown uh, toilets because that was all there was to get changed, and sort of e ended up on this empty floor plate uh, with the diplomatic protection squad and the prime minister. And I think <laughs> it was just one of those moments where we looked at each other and went. Okay, yeah, there's, there's something in this. There's another one of those moments right now. Two dads on your show, we both said to each other, we both need to go for a wee. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're waiting for this to wrap Absolutely. up and off to the toilet. So how do you want to um, progress, Rad Dads? What would you like the next step to be? Um, basically, we want the community to grow. I mean, it's really a conversation. So social media is a great enabler that, that allows us to have, um, I guess, a multi-dimensional kind of conversation. We've got content going up on, the, um, on the, a regular basis. So we've got video, um, you know, Facebook posts, that kind of thing. But we want to be able to bring people together in, in real life as well, have real conversations face-to-face, -face, eyeball guys as well. So we're looking at a schedule of events that are going to get jazz together, um, but also bring out to know that um, when times get tough, they can jump on that keyboard and sort of say, um, hey, look, I'm kind of struggling with this. Yeah. We had a really great example of that. Um, one guy who just had baby for the first time, um, really struggling with this idea that he thought baby didn't like him. 
And right. we had a, a massive long post of guys being able to jump on and say, you know what, mate? It's Babies don't like anyone. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's entirely normal. All right. four of my kids did exactly the same thing. And it was just, you know, those are the moments that we're trying oh, yeah. to really build. Oh, awesome. Brilliant. Sounds yeah. really cool. Yeah, um, awesome. Pleasure chatting to you guys. I'm looking forward to seeing Global Domination. Of Brad Dad, <laughs> yes. Uh, and a very happy Father's Day to you too. Thank Great you so Sunday. much. Now, hopefully all your hard work is paid off so your kids spoil you as well, <laughs> and you too. And if you want to join the Rad Dads movement, that Facebook address is on screen right now.